get these things clear out of this area. When we come back, we're just going to have the basement, which is, I think, a part of the factory. Maybe we'll do, like, the clearing of the whole factory next episode when we come back. Hmm. I hear something. What? Who's there? So, yeah, it's right there. Excellent. Where'd you go? Alright, I guess I'll just clear out this place. Oh, jeez. Alright. Um. Ooh, I leveled up. Look at that. I need to quit exiting out of it. I need to wait and see if a mysterious stranger shows up or not. I'm just gonna execute the super mutant warlord. Ooh. There's a lot of gunfire going on here. I like it. Mixing terminal. Um, I feel like this will allow us to get in there. Okay. Tour note number six. Take another head count at this time to ensure no guests wandering off the brewing area. This area houses the control systems that pump the various extracts and syrups that give our beverages their distinctive flavors. Below us, they are mixed with pure mainspring water. We use a combination of mechanical agitators and forced aer aeration to provide a perfectly consistent mixture. Proceed to bottling. What is this place? We came to the island a few weeks ago and I've been feeling strangely calm ever since we got here. Not sure if it's this weird Vim stuff or the fog, but the others don't seem to feel it. If anything, they seem more violent. Why are we doing this? We took out another group of harbormen today. Mostly I just stood there watching it as uh, Grun smashed his way through the camp. I don't know why we're doing it anymore. There's plenty of hunting on the island, but when I brought it up to the others, they threatened to kill me if I turned weak like all, one of the humans. Grunt took a swipe at me, but he's slow enough that I was able to dodge it. I'm getting out of here. I figured out a plan. I found the password to, to the storage area in the offices. If I can lock Grunt up in that section of the basement, the others are probably not going to be able to unlock the terminal. While they're busy trying to let him out, I'll be gone before they realize. I'll find somewhere quiet to live on my own, and if they manage to let Grunt out, he'll probably be so mad, he'll attack me. I wonder who Grun is. Okay. So yeah, that was, um, what was his name? Erickson. Or whatever. Oh, I already unlocked it. This must be the group of super mutants that he came here with. Oh my god, I'm not trying to unlock this shit. Oh, stop. There we go. Fuck. God. I kept accidentally hitting it. Jeez, alright, let's take care of him. Probably oh, kill this guy. Oh, another one. Great. No, no mysterious stranger on that one. Come on. Freeze him again. Oh, he didn't freeze him! Ah! He's like, I was just frozen. You can't freeze me again. Get out of here, Brian. With your terrible, lame tactics. Alright, let's finish. Uh, let's get that. Let's take these. I think I'm going to just start tossing around a bunch of frag grenades and see how that ends up. wonder if we cleared it out. Did we clear it out? No, we didn't clear it out. Oh, we did clear it out. Sweet. That's not true, though. There are other enemies, but... Okay. But, like, okay. <laughs> I'm cool with it. See? 
Why would it say we cleared it when we clearly didn't? We clearly didn't clear it. Hey, you get back here. <laughs> He's trying to like run. He's not going far though. I didn't even hit him. Wow. Oh, looks like you have a Securitron or whatever that you can activate. Tour notes five. Oh, there's so many tour notes. This is all stuff that we should probably do next episode. I was trying to find the exit and just kind of get out of here. But still um, read that terminal that I missed. That I should have read earlier. Oh, fuck. See, now I'm like down here. In the bottom section, I'm trying to not be. I did say I would like clear this place out though this episode instead. Oh, some mysterious stranger would pop up. Oh, here we go. Here's an exit. Okay, well, hopefully I'll remember that terminal. I mean, these terminals aren't very important. I can just do it later. There's a lot of reading to do too. It's a huge area. They put a lot of work into this like spot, it looks like. It's the Vim Pop Factory, though. It's got a lot of history behind it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, shit. Here we go. Would you look at that? Well, since this is the case, just pop in real quick. Cause we still gotta get whatever's in the safe. Turns. Shit. One with Cobra, huh? <sighs> Looks. Who could be who's? It's not the O. Sweet. Schedule. Talk with Willis and Manufacturing to sort out hazard pay. Update quarterly earnings report. Lunch with AC. Call Vernon Conroy and Nuka to set a meeting with board members. Call Sheriff's Department for update on Bar Brawl. Work on getting Iris to release the recipe for Captain's Blend. Meet AC at Bowling Alley. Quarterly earnings report. Okay. So I'm making like millions of dollars here. How dare you! How dare you? Miss Young, I don't care how many times the investors ask you to schedule a meeting with Nuka. My family is still the majority stockholder, and I am still the CEO. Vernon Conroy is a snake, and we will never work with Nuka. If you ever go behind my back again to set up meetings with our competitors, our employment with Vim will be immediately... Or your, your employment with Vim will be immediately terminated. Too soon to start production. Madison, what the heck? Leroy down in production said you were asking for the recipe for Captain's Blend to set up bulk ordering for production. He doesn't have the recipe because we can't even... We haven't even finished half our cycle of taste testing yet. I know it's testing well so far, but Doyle promised we wouldn't rush this out to market until we had time to refine it. You of all people know we can't afford to have this one fail. Iris Mason. Hazard pay. you got to be kidding me. How can you send, spend money on this big marketing push and not have money to pay, off our pay our staff hazard pay? That was the third truck that was hit this week. I'm telling you, someone is out to get us, and I can't ask for the guys to risk their safety for standard pay. All this marketing bullcrap doesn't amount to anything if Pop ain't on the shelves. Let's disengage this lock. That's some cool stuff in there. That's the roof, so we need to go this way and get the fuck out of here. Is 
live in the parking lot. I feel like it should say the outside. Because this sounds like a location to me. <laughs> Oh man, this episode's gonna be a long one. Maybe it'll be a two-parter. Who knows? We're getting up there. Oh, okay, so we are outside and we are in the parking lot. Okay. Okay. So I think that means we can actually fast travel. We'll do a little running around down here though. We still have. This is probably going to be a two part episode. The next episode will explore everything kind of like on the ground floor of the factory. And uh, as well as the, the basement, I think. Basically, we're going to be spending a lot of time here at the Vimpok factory. I think I was out here earlier, wasn't I? I was going to say, how's the thing not see me? Alright, cool. So yeah, this this is the, uh, the area, if you would have kept going. Like, we, we entered through the main entrance or whatever up here, and this is the area if you would have kept going around here. This is how you would have entered. It's pretty big. <laughs> it's a pretty big location. This place is huge. It looks like a fucking asylum almost. Like an insane asylum. Oh, I did level up. That's right. Let's go ahead and do that, too, since... This is already going to be long. Uh, what was I working on lately? Was I just putting points into stuff? I might have been. I know on my other file I've been putting points into strength. Toughness is cool. Lead belly. Oh, that's what I was doing. Life giver. Woo! Slowly regenerate lost health. I like it. Alright, so we'll come back here next episode to take care of our final business. We're going to fast travel to the Nucleus and talk to Mia, Maya, whatever the fuck her name is. Oh. Oh, yeah. So we gotta go install the pump still, and she's got a bullshit with her, and oh, you know, you guys know. Can't wait though, cause I, I'm gonna go eat something after this. I haven't ate yet today. Well, it's not entirely true. I had a little like dollar sausage biscuit sandwich from 7-Eleven when I ran there earlier. Let's pick up a Red Bull. So, I did eat that. I'm about to heat up some of that Chinese food from yesterday and smash that. Because I still have a lot of the rice. A lot of the, a lot of the fried rice and the Szechuan chicken left. They really give you a lot, too. I wish they gave you more shrimp when I order, like... Or at least the place I go to doesn't really give you a lot of shrimp. My. With uh, shrimp Real dishes. Good to have Sister Gwyneth back. Now you... Finally got that regulator from the Vim factory. You did? Oh, thank God it didn't oh, freeze. Fantastic. It was auto saving. So that okay. regulator should slot right into the <laughs> apparatus downstairs. My bypass to the filters should take care of the rest, unless I mess something up. Those arches should start spraying all the irradiated water the children could ask for. I was thinking, since you did all the heavy lifting, you ought to be the one to christen the old girl. Plug in the final piece. You willing to do the honors? So. 
All you did was bypass the decontamination filters. Well, if you want to oversimplify the heck out of it, yeah. Pretty much. I had to hook up a little rig to support my fix. But so long as that keeps working, it should keep the rads coming. So, you willing to finish the job? Could the bypass be reversed? Uh, sure. Theoretically, <laughs> if my Theoretically. Fail, which is possible. There are going to be some wet, unhappy children of Adam, though, if that happens. But we're not going to know either way until that regulator's in place. Now, how about you take care of that missing piece? Demand caps. I risked a lot getting this thing for you. I think I've earned some caps. Suppose that's fair. I can swing, say, 150. <laughs> if you'd seen this place, you'd know that's not enough. I, mutants, floor to ceiling. Wow, really? Okay, sure. 250. I'm not sure you're grasping what I went through here. <laughs> Have I described the smell to you yet? All right, all right. 350. But that's as high as I can go. Sure. I can take care of that. Great. Pumps down in the bay. Shouldn't give you any trouble. And here. Uh-huh. Woo! Oh, I'm over-encumbered, I think. Mai. Hate to have to charge the faithful, but my supply... Nice. Uh -huh. I banked on her. I'll take a look. Nothing's junk if you use it. Alright, let's see. Should probably sell stuff that weighs amounts. Problem is, I don't really know. How encumbered am I? Seven pounds? Alright. Trust in Adam. But don't leave the bay without stocking up. You need something? Let's see what you have. Probably have something. Someone's making a lot of noise over there. Alright, so seven pounds, huh? Just like nothing. Keep that campground banner. Is it all collectibles? Yeah. AP 100, HP 600, charisma minus 2. Eh. Eh, just to get rid of it. I don't really want it. I don't really want these Nuka Cola Quantums either, but they're like kind of like an all heal. For me, like an instant super heal. That's what I kind of treat them as. So I do keep them around. It's pretty nice too. I should use those brews more often. I should probably just get rid of one of these. Let's see, which one's garbage? Yeah, that one looks like garbage. I can get rid of that. Whatever, I'll just get rid of all that. <laughs> That's fine. Alright, now I'm not encumbered anymore. Let's go ahead and install this and complete the quest so I can end this damn episode. I gotta go empty out all my stuff at the uh, cabin anyway, it seems like. Ouch. That hurt. Do nothing. Yeah, see, if you have seven intelligence or higher, you can reverse my bypass fixing the decontamination system. I'm not gonna do that, though. Oh, I should have read that. You easily snap the pump regulator into place. The machinery immediately begins feeding irradiated water into the system. Now I gotta go test it. But yeah, I don't know, you can you can do that so it just sprays water instead, I guess. But I'm being a pretty devoted child of Adam right now, lately, so... I've been hanging out here for quite a while, last like four or five episodes. Wow, this is a long way up. And go even higher up there. What's up, where? Zealot, where? Where's that zealot at? I don't know. Where's over there? Who, what, where, when, why? Let's test it. Oh, yeah, so radiated. Oh, God. That's good. Oh, jeez. Oh, I love it. So that's cool. So that's their version of a decontamination chamber, I guess. Um, so we'll get rid of that. I guess we'll end the episode here. Next episode, we're gonna start inside here talking to, um, Grandmaster, or Grand whatever, <laughs> High Confessor, Tectus, Tectonic Plate. And there we go, that clears up those, so we just have these two now for this place. I want to get rid of these. 
stupid. It looks like I can't even like get rid of this one. It's probably because I gotta talk to this one. Did this one fail? I don't know. Anyway, next episode we're gonna be talking to Tectus. So I'm gonna go ahead and enter here and <laughs> save the game there, end the episode here, whatever. Um, I am gonna run off and deposit all that shit though at the at Longfellow's cabin off camera, so you guys don't have to deal with that at all. It's just a bunch of killing time. So anyway, yeah, I'll just end the episode here in front of his big sweet chair. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and to consider subscribing to the channel. You can also follow me on Twitter for updates. My name is Brian, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one.